and I thought that I would pull out the camera just so I can show you guys how I curl my hair. Uh, fun fact is I did not know how to use a curling iron until I got this. This curling iron just makes it so easy and I love it. I'll leave it linked down below in case you guys are interested in getting it for yourself or in case you want to send it to your boyfriend or husband to get it for you for Christmas. <laughs> Seriously, it's worth it. And I have Sawyer, which is my cat. She's here on the counter eating. So if you could hear her, don't mind her. I figured I would do my hair today because I don't really style my hair that often, especially since I'm home, I just kind of wear it natural and that's honestly the key to growing out your hair if you want it healthy and you know, it's best looking, then definitely don't style your hair every day. Another thing I will say is if you do style your hair, try and make it last. Um, I'll style my hair once and then I'll wear it like that for like three or four days. You're not supposed to wash your hair every day and I know, trust me, it gets hard, especially if you have oily hair like me. My hair is very, very fine and just very thin, so it gets oily very fast. So dry shampoo is my best friend for sure. So. As you can see, like I'm just going through my hair so quickly. This side is pretty much done. I don't really section off my hair all the time unless like I want it to be absolutely perfect, but just for like during the week since I'll be home and I'm just mainly doing this for myself, I won't section off my hair. I'll just kind of grab random hair and curl it not really worrying about it being like perfect. And to be honest, I kind of like the more messy look. But if you watched my vlog yesterday, you saw that I got some new gold jewelry from Gold Stranger. And this is my first time wearing it. I'm so excited. You can see how beautiful it is. I'll show you more like in the natural light after I'm done doing my hair, but I'm just so in love with it. And I'm gonna finish curling my hair and then I need to go make some coffee. This is my hair complete. I swear this only took like 10 minutes. And like I said, um, when I don't want it to be like super perfect, I kind of just take random pieces. You want that one? All right, close this. Close it. All right, let's make coffee. Whoa. Okay, which one should we pick today? Good choice. Ooh, hold on. <laughs> Remember, you gotta wait until the light is done flashing. Wait. Okay. Now push. Oops. There we go. <laughs> crazy ah. there. And then let's put some coffee creamer in. <laughs> I know. I love coffee creamer. <gasps> Thank you, baby. Thank you. Hot. Yes, hot. Very hot. Thank you, my love. Mm -hmm. I'm just finishing up with work and I'm also uploading tomorrow's vlog. And I'm trying to do my videos to where I'm like one video ahead. That way, if there's ever a day where I'm not feeling good or I'm just exhausted, I'll still have a video to put up for you guys. Um, but I just got a package delivered and this is from Glossier. And I have been obsessed 
with their products. I ordered, what did I order? Oh, I ordered a face wash and then I ordered one of their um, bomb.com salves and I was obsessed. I've already gone through, I think like half of it. And um, the face wash is also really great. I didn't want to repurchase until I finished the whole thing. So I still have quite a bit left, but I only ordered the mini size and it's the milk jelly cleanser, but it works so, so good. The first one that I got is coconut and this one is the rose. So it's pink with a green cap. It looks so cute. And oh, it's even tinted a little bit. It's kind of like, kind of, you probably can't even see, but it's like a light pink color, really cute. And this stuff, I swear, it makes your lips so baby smooth and I just love it. And I also ordered this Glossier uh, Solution Exfoliator. So it's basically like a toner, but it exfoliates and it has AHA, BHA, and PHA and salicylic acid, which is great for breaking down like everything in your pores and stuff. So I'm really excited to try this out. You gotta be. Say you gotta be. Baby. Say you gotta be, Mama. Huh? Mama. You wanna dance? You're gonna need lights to climb a mountain. You gotta keep the light close to you I'll be the pillow when you're stumbling And in my arms I'll keep you to sleep then I can finally start doing like my skincare and everything like that so first thing is I put my hair up get it out of my face and then I will take off my jewelry my necklaces even though these are real gold and they won't tarnish I still want to keep them looking as shiny and pretty as possible. So I'm gonna take these off that way. I don't get any water or oils, lotions, products like that. While I took off my jewelry, I wanted to show you how I put my jewelry. So I have this cute little Buddha that I got from Home Goods a long time ago. And I just hang my necklaces from him. So I have this Chanel piece that I also got from gold stranger and then here is my new piece that I got and so this these are just kind of the jewelry that I wear every single day sometimes I'll put like my scrunchies or my jewelry hanging like that I just think it's so cute and I have talked about this before but this is my favorite makeup remover it's like a gel based formula and you basically just massage it into your skin and it kind of melts everything off. So 
So once I rinse that off, then I go in with the Glossier Milk Jelly. And then I just wash my face with that. Okay, now that I wash my face, I just pat it dry. And then I'm gonna go in with a cotton round. I actually got these from Amazon and I love them so, so much. So they're washable. It comes with like a little um, netted bag that you put them in after you use them. And then you just throw that in the washer. I think they're bamboo cloth or something like that. But um, it's a really great alternative instead of using like a cotton pad and also better for the earth. So I'm using my new Glossier solution, but I'll definitely give you guys an updated review once I've used this a few more times and once I can tell you my true and honest opinion on it, but it feels good so far. And I always make sure to get in the hairline because if you wear any kind of makeup or anything like that, you do get oil there as well. So you wanna make sure to clean and then I go down my neck. Okay. And then, like I said, I'll show you guys the little, here we go. So, and then once I've used all of these, I just toss them in the washer. And I'll link them down below. Um, like I said, I did get them from Amazon. So, really, really love those. And you also save money in the long run rather than having to keep repurchasing um, cotton rounds and stuff. And then I'm gonna go in with this Estee Lauder um, Advanced Night Repair Serum. I'm almost out. This is just like a little baby one. But I really love this stuff. It really does moisturize your face and it helps tone your skin. As I am letting that dry, I'm gonna show you guys a really cool tip. So this is Lash Lashes MD. So it's supposed to help your eyelashes grow. Um, however, this one kind of like dries and leaves like little flakies in my eyelashes. I do love the Babe Lash one a lot better for your eyelashes. But this one, since I don't want it to go to waste, I put it in my eyebrow hair and it just thickens up your eyebrows and it also helps them grow so like if you over plucked like i always do then definitely suggest this because it will definitely make them look a lot more full and it just helps them grow so much faster. And I only put it like obviously where you want the hair to grow, um, where you want your brows to be a little bit more full. So I put that in there and then as the serum was drying, then I'm gonna go in with the First Aid Ultra Repair Cream. This is my new favorite cream. I use it day and night. It is so full, it came like filled to the top, top, top. And this stuff just works so amazing. And your skin just soaks it up. So at first when you put it on, your skin will probably look like a glazed donut. <laughs> but I promise it sinks in. And it just makes your face, your skin so soft. Yeah, that is what I have been doing for skincare. And then I'll brush my teeth and then I will put on like some lip gloss and stuff. But before I brush my teeth, I wanna drink some hot tea. So I'll show you guys the tea that I've been loving. Sawyer. 
doing in the hamper? You silly girl. So I start by warming up some water in the microwave, usually for a minute or a minute and a half. And this is a tea that I have been loving. It's called Well Rested and I get it from Trader Joe's. It honestly has like a peppermint taste to it. It's really, really good and just calming. And to me, it tastes like, I don't know, it tastes like a spa, <laughs> if that even makes sense. But I always put a little bit of raw honey in there. This one is from Trader Joe's as well but this just kind of sweetens it up. And I just like let that melt in there. And then I'll let that steep for eh, usually about five minutes. And if I need to reheat it, then I can put it in the microwave for another minute or 30 seconds, whatever. But it's just so good. And it has melatonin in it, I think, um, but it just really relaxes you. And I swear like 30 minutes after drinking this, I'm just exhausted and ready to go to sleep. So this is usually what my nightstand looks like. I usually light a candle and then I have my hydro flask full of water here and then my tea I'll drink until I fall asleep. But I'm gonna go ahead and close out this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and we'll see you tomorrow.